<coughs> Here we are <coughs> going to learn how to create a smart class uh, with Microsoft Teams. So whatever the class you have, just go on second option and then start a new class or new smart class, a virtual class, Microsoft Teams, continue it and then put the title whatever the class you have let's say ICT okay and then which class uh, I'm trying to do with 6B at the moment today is 26 uh, whenever you have class just use the time and date everything now it's 12.43 so I'm just choosing after 3 minutes it will start and if you want to show, if you don't want to share, and with the, uh, if you don't want to share, then choose none. Otherwise, your school or library is so better. So your school, submit. And then here you have class. The class will appear here. You watch your class. Just click on view button to jump into watch your class. And here, <coughs> first time, what you're gonna do, you will, you have, you must have your username and password. You will uh, put your username and password. Then click on download the window app instead of joining on the web in, because uh, if your net internet is slow or uh, there is something problem with the Microsoft Teams software itself or class Sierra, so it will take time to do this. So it's better download the web. Once you click on it, you will have set up file. So just simply click, it will download automatically. Then you will have on screen this Microsoft team. Okay. So whenever you open this one, just simply click on open Microsoft team. In this way, your all recording uh, will save with you. Okay. As I have these all recording in activity. I will show you later on but let me join this one now and before joining you if you want to show your webcam cam, so turn on otherwise turn off this one camera your mic should be turned on and then click on join now so if uh, you have class your student will ask you the uh, window will open here permission that this student want to uh, join this class so you will just allow I don't have any student at the moment uh, or I have one uh, I'm just waiting for her I have one student so virtual class no refresh refresh page okay here uh, let's say in share you have all things means if you want to share your desktop okay or if you want to show your uh, whatever the software you open in your system if you want to share that software you can share only that software otherwise your screen okay it's up to you like uh, at the moment I have these all software open in my system so I can open see there is one student who want to join so let me first start with the uh, okay one student I have now so let's share I can see uh, conversation she just joined or participant you can see the participant here if you don't want uh, the text option and uh, share your screen I want to share like my screen so whatever I am doing students are watching me this red line means that uh, they are watching you if you want to give control give them otherwise don't give them control if you will give them control then any student can share their screen with you okay So if I uh, uh, hurry, can you l hear me? Please answer. Yes. Please answer on the mic. Okay, she is talking. I think her mic is not connected. 
okay this one is uh, if you want to share anything uh, with your student like any file so you can attach file from here let's say I have this this is a big file let me select the small file this one publish tool open it so this is a way to sharing uh, I already actually shared this one so keep uh, replies okay you can attach any sound file any video file any file that you want to share with your student or text or you have other softwares like uh, related to education you can also share these all education educational channel that I'm working I'm using this one Quizlet with my student so add to team you can add to team Qu Quizlet let's say Quizlet yes, you make sure it's um, this before you share this one you have to go to the Quizlet and make sure let's say I here I save this one from Quizlet okay so you make sure that you this is uh, on the Quizlet so you can put the same query over there so it will join if it's not working then right click on the option and go to your class and you can share the same way as I told you in the chat chat activity you can even put the let me send this message you can send the share here okay so you can use any app that available here these all app, app which is related to your subject you can search all the app and you can work with it and all the classes as my classes are I can see my all previous classes here okay whatever I have done with me is recorded and it's recorded over there in your class there as well So if you stop uh, sharing the screen, you can just simple stop button on sharing the screen. Now still students are with you. You can communicate with me, uh, with them. You can send any messages to them, any file, anything. That's it. Thank you. Thanks for watching.